Hi fans of high quality entertainment. Uh, what I'm doing here is I'm using my old microphone. This is going to take a, a minute to explain. <laughs> but I bought a new microphone. It's called the Blue Yeti Blackout. And right now I don't have it plugged in. I, I'm using my older mic. Well, it's not that old. I bought it in April. <laughs> but I'm going to be showing you the difference between what I'm using now and the Blue Yeti ultimate USB microphone for professional recording. I guess I better start being professional. So I use, you know, I use this for my live chats. And right now, my air conditioning is on. I'm not sure if you can hear it with this microphone. You probably can. I don't have any other... I'm using OBS Studio to record this, and I don't have any filters or anything. So it's just going out the way it is. So this is... This is called the Bud Poff, and it was $40. And it, it's a good microphone. I'm, I was happy with it overall. The only thing is I didn't like is the volume. It doesn't stop. It just spins around and around. So sometimes you don't know where the level is at. And it comes with this. I'll have information here for you. I believe Glenn might be buying this off me for her. A good price if he's interested if it works i think it will would work for his um, i think he's got a mac so there here's the filter on it i don't know if there's any difference with the filter there probably is a bit of a difference uh but like i said it's a it's a good microphone and uh but i wanted a better microphone for my viewers for doing live chat so I'm going to show you the difference. I'm going to stop this recording and I'm going to plug in my... Uh, I'm going to show you before I plug it in because it is very sensitive when I'm moving it around. But, and I bought the filter separate for $10. There it is. And I'll explain now. When I was using it, I did use it for the last uh, live chat with... Uh, Pop Goes the 60s and Fit to be Tie Dyed. But I was using it the wrong way. Uh, I had it, you know, so it's facing facing my mouth like that. And it's not supposed to, it's supposed to be standing up like that because the, it's coming in here, right? It's coming in here, not, not at the top. But I, I've actually, from watching tutorials, I'm having it leaned back a bit. So it's just away from me like that. And it's got four patterns. And I'll try and remember to put the patterns here. And so the pattern I use yeah, is the car, cor, cardoid. Cardoid? for game streaming, Skype and Discord, podcast and voiceovers. And the other ones are omnidirectional for conference calls, field recordings, events, orchestras. Uh, bidirectional, which is for interviews, instruments and vocal duets. And stereo, for vocals, ensemble, choir and instruments. But definitely if you're just, you know, one person, and you're doing a, a live stream, then the one to have it on is the cardoid, as you can see here. Yeah, mic gain control. It uh, just helps with the loudness and also uh, you don't want to turn it up too much because then it picks up the background noises and all that. So I have my gain set fairly low. I still don't know what I'm doing half but you know you just learn as you go along and I have watched some very good tutorials on this and now I'm just making one and telling you that what I think of this uh, blue yeti even though it's black it's called blue yeti and you can get them in different colors so there's the microphone and then of course a filter which helps with the pops but like I said it's not plugged in yet you'll see the difference so, this is the one I was using. You can see Jinxie. 
So I'll be back with the other microphone. And when I when I come back with the other microphone, I'm going to first have it the way I had it during the, the last live stream where it's facing towards me. It was better sound even that way than this, the one I'm using now, but it was much better sound quality having it facing away from me. So I'm back with the Blue Yeti plugged in. And like I said, it's, it's not set up properly yet, so hopefully the audio will get a little better. And I do have my air conditioning going, as I mentioned before. So I'll be quiet for a second, see if you can hear it or not. And uh, hopefully it's not too, too loud. And of course, my computer and everything. And so I'm going to set it back. It's like this right now. And like I said, it's very sensitive. That's the one... I guess maybe a negative about it, you know, if you're typing or whatever. But overall, this has great reviews online. But there's always going to be people that will say it's no good. Hi, fans of high quality entertainment. I now sound like a true professional. Hopefully. And like I said, uh, if I use OBS, I do sometimes put filters on, but I don't think I need it for this. You know, if there's a, a little tiny bit of background noise, you know, that's fine, uh, as long as it's not annoying. Uh, but I would love your thoughts on the difference in the sound quality compared to my $40 microphone. But for me, for the little time I've used it, and I have used it on P Patreon too, I've been very happy with the sound quality. And so, if you're looking for a professional USB mic, uh, I highly recommend the Blue Yeti, the ultimate professional USB microphone. And it's pretty, uh, especially for me, it's pretty simple. You plug it into the USB and... You know, there might be a setting or two you have to play with. And then, of course, you have to play with the settings on the microphone to get the levels the way you want them. But it's overall, it's very easy to use. And like I said, there are great tutorials on YouTube, including this one now. <laughs> uh, so... highly. And the other thing I, I could do at some point, maybe, but I'm in no rush to do it is to get it so the microphone is hanging so it's not on the desk uh, even though it comes with this little filter thing that you stand it on uh, that's about it though so anybody looking for a for a really good usb microphone with great sound quality don't buy this one see i like i, li I like to confuse people on my channel <laughs> you were just recommending it a minute ago. <laughs> so thanks for watching, everybody, and uh, have a great day. Bye.